I have known Carter since he was in second grade and the difference in his behavior, academics, total, the way he carries himself, tremendous, tremendous difference. Carter makes sure that he is polite to everyone around him, but the best thing with Carter is where we started to where we are. So Carter was nominated um, because of even just where he started this year to where he is now. Um, Carter had a behavior plan and he had a goal that he needed to meet by the middle of this year. Within the first month, month and a half, Carter already met that behavior goal. So Carter no longer even has a bit, which is a behavior plan, but that is like, the, like such a difference to the response that you used to get from Carter because he willingly goes and even if I have to be like, well, just go and listen. This way he's just getting the material and listening to the material. Like that's better than nothing. But he, to, to get him to go over is no longer a fight. Sometimes, like I said, not too thrilled with it, but he works well with his peers. Lunch, sits with his peers, conversates with his peers. He's so much more in control of his emotions and his feelings and has learned how to cope and deal with them which is one of the biggest things about Carter. So with leadership, um, Carter has definitely come a very long way. And he is not just in my class, but he's also in another class in school. He always wants to take initiative. So even if we're doing something in my classroom that he doesn't do in his other classroom, he takes the role to put himself and actually want to do that with others. Carter's a real kid because he shows leadership and always, so even in the classroom, you could tell the things that he's taken on, how it's going to carry on with him. Like it's, you could tell things are just not gonna be in the class setting, but it's life, which to me, that's one of the most important things about being an educator. Yes, I know it's academics, but it's the teaching the life and the life skills and Carter has learned so many life skills that he's going to take on that he will show people like he is a leader. They will want to follow in his footsteps. But those are huge leadership qualities where he wants people to come together. He wants people to collaborate. He wants people to get along. It's, that's actually very important to Carter. Respect is very important to Carter, which totally makes him a real kid because what, what quality is the best in life than knowing how to respect others.